Okay, this is going to be a little video to show you how to uh, set up the assignment, the text analysis assignment. You have to download some stuff and uh, put it on your computer. So hopefully this will help. Um, what you're going to want to do is when you click the link in the portal, uh, take it back. Let's do this first. First thing you want to do is open your finder. If you're on a PC, you're going to open up the folder and, and kind of do the same way. What we're trying to here's the big picture. We are trying to get to the same place where we always have our processing programs. We're going to create a new folder called Text Analysis for Assignment. Uh, inside that folder, we're going to create another folder called Data. And then we're going to download the sketch from the portal, <clears throat> from the link on the portal to the uh, Text Analysis for Assignment folder. And then we now have two other files we need to get from the link on the portal and download those into, download those into the data file. So here are the steps. First, I'm going to open up my Finder, um, and I'm going to find where I keep processing. Uh, this is where I really hope you guys are starting to use your Finder a little bit more than searching, because it, it's going to be needed for this case. So right now, most of you are probably going to go to Documents, and in Documents, you have a folder called Processing. If I go into that folder, double-clicking, here's a bunch of, these are not, of course, all of our assignments, but these are some. I really keep mine in a different place. But what we're going to do now is you can do a couple different things. You can either use a two-finger click to do a right-click and say a new folder, or you can do file, new folder. Either way, when you say new folder, it's waiting for you to name it. If you click somewhere, you're going to, I'll show you what to do if you, if you goof up. In fact, I'll do it right now. If I, if I click somewhere else, now I have untitled folder. If that happens, you go back, click, wait a second, click again. Now you can rename it. It needs to be text analysis for assignment. Just like that, camel case, all cap. I mean, all words are caps, right? Okay, now I have that rename. I go into it. I'm going to need to do a new folder. This one I named, I named data, small d data. Now I'm good to go, all right? So um, I'm going to go download that link from here. This is, after I click the link, this is what I should see. This quiz review, it does not apply. I'm sorry about that. I'll get rid of that. But in the meantime, you can do it a, a couple of steps. There's other ways to do this. If you get it to work on your own, great. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this text analysis for assignment, right click on it, and say download. Now, if your settings automatically go to the download folder, um, I, would, I can help you change that. But if that's the case, um, then you're going to have to copy and drag. If it's not the case, you can go right here to Documents, Processing, Text Assignment, text analysis for assignment and download it right there. Okay, and There's my data folder too, as you can see. But I'm going to do it uh, like a lot of you have, where it goes directly to downloads, okay? So we're going to save it to downloads. So I'm just going to click Save. Now what I want to do is go to my Finder. Here, it's already open. I need to go to Downloads. You can always sort by date. So the, lot, so the most recent one will be at the top. Click that. There it is. Text analysis for assignment today. So I'm going to click on that. You can you can try dragging, but again, if we're going to try to get it into a couple of folders deep. It might be easier to again right click and say copy. Go back to documents. Go back to text analysis and paste it. It's already here. <laughs> this is because I did this a couple of days ago. I'm not interesting how. Uh, I don't know why it's looking at it. But anyway, I'm going to say paste item. In my case, I'll say replace. And there you go. Next step, go back to here. Double click on data. The two files we absolutely need are Frankenstein and Top 1000. And you might want to download the source code pro. And that's going to give you the font also. So same thing for each of these. Right click, download. It's going to go into your downloads folder. Save. Or put it in the, directly in the folder that you want, the data folder, so you can see where I'm going with this. Uh, downloads, Frankenstein, copy, documents, uh, text analysis for assignment, data. It's already there, but again, I can paste it. You want to do it, well, I can, if you double click and open it all the way, it's a little bit easier than you can just paste down here, but you can paste it right on top of the folder too. But anyway, I'm going to do it this way. Paste item. Uh, well, you won't have to say replace, but I do. And then do the same thing with the top 1000. And if you don't want to mess with the font and you, you want to make sure the font that I give you works, 
Um, you should download that too. So I'm going to do both of those now. This one is optional. If, if you don't do this, you just have to get rid of all the font references or, or change it to Arial, A-R-I-A-L, which is built into all of our Macs. Save those, go back to my um, downloads. In this case, I did two, so it's, or I actually did three, excuse me, I just did two. So, so I can do a shift click on the second one so I can do more than one at a time. Copy two items, documents, text analysis, data, paste. And one of them I have to replace. That's fine. There you go. From that point, you should be able to now uh, double click on this uh, program. And there you go. You open the file. And if I run it, it'll give me the initial uh, text analysis. That's it. Thank you very much.